Now we'll do a more challenging dimensional analysis problem. In this presentation, we're going to convert the speed of light, 2.998 from 10, times 10 to the 8th meters per second, into the units furlongs per fortnight. You're probably asking yourself what the heck a furlong or a fortnight is. Don't worry, we'll ask Wikipedia. According to Wikipedia, a furlong is a unit of length equivalent to 660 feet. A fortnight is a unit of time equivalent to 14 days. Some other equivalent statements to be aware of are 1 foot equals 12 inches, 1 inch equals 2.54 centimeters, 1 day equals 24 hours, 1 hour equals 3600 seconds, and 1 meter equals 100 centimeters. By expressing these equivalent statements as quotients, we will get the conversion factors we need to solve the problem. We begin the calculation by drawing a flat line. Everything on top of the line is in the numerator, everything below the line is in the denominator. And then the first number we record is our given, 2.998 times 10 to the 8th meters per second. The first conversion we perform is to convert meters to centimeters using the conversion factor 100 centimeters equals 1 meter. Next we convert centimeters to inches using the equivalency statement 2.54 centimeters equals 1 inch. Then we convert inches to feet. Everyone knows there are 12 inches in one foot. And the last distance conversion we do is one of the esoteric ones. There are 660 feet in one foot long. Now we begin our time conversions. There are 3600 seconds in one hour. This converts seconds in the denominator to hours in the denominator. Our next time conversion is to convert hours in the denominator to days in the denominator using the conversion factor of 24 hours in one day. And here's our last time conversion, converting days in the denominator into fortnights in the denominator. There are 14 days in one fortnight. Now we should make sure that our units cancel properly. So, meters cancel, seconds cancel, centimeters cancel, inches cancel, feet cancel, furlongs do not cancel, hours cancel, and days cancel. We're left with an answer in furlongs per fortnight, which is what we were looking for. So to accomplish this on the calculator, we take every number in the numerator that is not 1, we multiply it together. Then we divide that by the product of everything in the denominator that is not 1. So everything in the numerator is our given, 2.998 times 10 to the 8th, then 100, then 3600, then 24, then 14. The important digits in our denominator are 2.54, 12, and 660. Multiply it all together, and you get 1.80 times 10 to the 12th furlongs per fortnight. The speed of light, as everyone knows. Thanks for watching.